OpenAI recently launched a new feature called Tasks. This feature allows you to schedule tasks like cron jobs in ChatGPT. Now, in today's video, we're going to do a comprehensive overview of ChatGPT tasks. I'm going to show you everything about tasks, how you can start using them, and what you should be using them for, as well as I'm going to give you this comprehensive guide to download for free, which includes seven free prompts that you can use to create your very own ChatGPT tasks. Let's dive right into it. All right, guys, so like I said, this resource will be linked down below as well as all the other different links and resources that I cover in today's video. So, all right, so first things first, we're actually going to take a look at the ChatGPT interface and how you can start using tasks. So if you didn't already notice, when you're logged into ChatGPT and you will currently have to be on the plus, the pro and or the team plans in order to get this feature, it's not available to the free plan just as of yet. But you'll be able to go up here and select your different model. Now you will see that there is GPT 4.0 with scheduled tasks. So whenever you're creating a task, you would want to go here. So here you could tell ChatGPT to schedule a specific, you know, reminder or talk to you at a specific time, whether that's daily, weekly, etc. Or you can also use a little bit more advanced features such as the search the web functionality. So this unlocks a whole different realm of options because you can get ChatGPT to research for you on specific times like research for your YouTube videos daily or research for your business daily, do competitor research daily or different stock or trading watchers that will basically tell you the specific stock price or different things on the market. The possibilities are really endless. So you'll see here in the document, I also link to the help center right here. So if you want, you can go to the help center of ChatGPT read up on scheduled tasks right here, such as general information, who it's for, how to set up a specific task if you have trouble following along in this video, and how to make sure that your notifications are turned on, because that's one thing that you're definitely going to want to do. All right, so a few key features of tasks. So schedule recurring tasks at custom intervals, desktop notifications for task updates, task management interface with pause, edit, delete capabilities, real-time monitoring and updates, and custom instructions support for each task. So if you're in ChatGPT and you come up to your picture here and then click on settings, you will see notifications and you will see tasks. So you can change this and make sure that you're getting either push notifications, email, or both. You're probably going to want both. And this is an example of what a task notification looks like to my email, task update, uh, AI ideas trending. Now, another thing that I mentioned in the guide there is if you go to customize ChatGPT, you can customize your ChatGPT experience here. And this will be useful just really any time you're using ChatGPT because you can describe the traits that ChatGPT should have, what you do, how ChatGPT should call you, and then anything else you wanted to know about it, what capabilities should it use. So this is a good feature that I would definitely recommend you guys implement as well, just in general when you're using ChatGPT tasks or anything else. Now, if you're having trouble turning on desktop notifications while you're on the desktop app, you may need to use OpenAI ChatGPT when you're in your browser, just as a heads up. Now, a few different categories you could create tasks for. It could be market and competition monitoring, personal development and productivity. So different things like daily learning or habits exercises, reminders, whatever the case may be, business intelligence, financial management, health and wellness. I left some examples here in the, the resource for you guys. Let's actually get into the seven prompts that you can use right now or customize these for your specific use case and show you actually how this works. So first things first, we have our content creators daily brief. So the prompt goes like this. I create content about topic. Report this to me every morning at 8 a.m. Analyze what's trending and give me three viral ideas that are gaining traction. Key hashtags to use for each idea. What my target audience is actively searching for right now. And focus on ideas that have high engagement but aren't oversaturated yet. So if we go ahead, copy this prompt right here. Go over to chat GPT tasks and we paste this in. So I'm going to say I create content about AI and instead of 8 a.m. I'm going to say 1157 p.m. because it's 1156 p.m. right now. All right. So I actually said 1158 p.m. because we missed seven. And as you can see here, a task was created. Report trending AI content. Got it. I'll report that for you to you every day at 1158 
p.m. Now, make sure that you see this um, little, you know, card right here. This shows that a task was created and we can edit our task, pause our task, view all tasks. But sometimes if you're not specific, like with report this to me every day at this time or every week at on Sunday at this time, then it may not create the task. So make sure you're specific with it and you see this card. So if we click on edit here, you can see that we have our task name, our instructions, the schedule right here. So doesn't repeat daily, weekly, monthly, annually, custom. And then the time right here, as you can see, we got 11.58 p.m. We could delete, pause, etc. I'm just going to cancel. Now, also, if we go to tasks right here, you will see all of our tasks right here. So you'll see different scheduled ones right here, like the daily ones. You can pause them, delete them from here, edit them as well. Now, it is actually 11.59 p.m. So if everything went well, we should have got a task update from our uh, task here. Let's go ahead and check. And looks like we got one one minute ago at 11.58. We can see trending AI topics for creators. Let's go ahead and view this message. And boom, look what we got here. We got our report. So here are some emerging AI content ideas with high engagement and low saturation along with key hashtags and current audience searches. AI and climate modeling and sustainability. Obviously, the AI is a very broad topic. If you're putting an industry, I'd recommend going even more specific so you're going to get a good search um, result. AI powered creativity in arts and media, um, AI in education, bridging the digital divide, content idea right here, examine whatever, key hashtags here. We can see the different sources like so and the audience searches. So pretty good. Now, like I said, it all comes down to your prompts. So these prompts that I'm giving you are just examples and templates. I would definitely recommend changing these around and improving on them and making your own. These are just examples to get the creative juices flowing for you. Okay, so I'm not going to show you all the other ones being implemented, but they're going to be in the guide right here. So here's one search for stock and crypto or symbol daily at market open or specific time i would change some of this and make it the specific time and notify me about the news around it and stuff like price drops below x amount or major news breaks about the asset different stuff like that you can you know change this around dream home finder so search daily at 9 a.m for property type in my area specific area i would change that and notify me when you find a price that below this new listings that match my criteria recent price drops over five percent exclude properties with pending offers and include distance from city center in updates are you tired of pouring thousands of dollars into appointment setters only to watch leads slip away imagine having a team of elite sales agents booking qualified appointments for you around the clock no more wasted time on training no more frustration with performance and no more draining your budget on inconsistent and expensive call centers introducing stride agents ai powered appointment setters that work 24 7 never get tired and book appointments while you sleep trained on thousands of successful conversations our ai agents outperform human teams at just one tenth of the cost join the ranks of businesses that doubled their appointments and booking rates in just a matter of weeks don't get left behind in the ai revolution visit strideagents.com now and transform your entire sales process with cutting edge ai technology it's time to accelerate your stride with ai agents now some of this i would just make it more simple and make it very specific for what you're looking for i'm just giving you examples for specific use cases now dream home finder could be dream car finder it could be you know literally just anything that you're trying to buy finder right i'm just giving you some examples here so we also have a flight deal hunter so search daily right here for different flights with different criteria here all right and then market opportunity scanner so check daily at specific time for topics growing over 100 percent since yesterday new market opportunities emerging co competitor launches or major updates focus on actionable insights and include potential first movers advantage daily learning so help me learn topic by sending me one new key lesson and practical exercise every day and then viral trend monitor so search by trending topics in industry and notify me on any trends growing fast okay a couple best practices for tax creation uh, clear success criteria and contextual parameters 
So like I said, your prompts are super key. I know I give you some examples here, but definitely refine them down to your specific use case. And then lastly, what this means for the future with AI, I think this is huge. I mean, this is very small in the grand scheme of it, but it is a big stepping stone to the direction that we're going to see in 2025 moving forward, going towards agents that are able to do autonomous tasks, different things, manage different things for you. So the automation evolution, workflow integration, and business impact is going to be directly affected by this type of innovation and progression that we're seeing. And a few things to remember, tasks should be specific and measurable, include relevant context and constraints, and then start simple and scale gradually. All right, so that's pretty much it for this video on ChatGPT OpenAI's tasks. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments down below. Like I said, the resources covered in today's video will be linked down below for free, so you can take a look, download them, look at the prompts, try them out yourself. If you have any prompts that worked really well for you or specific use cases, let me know as well as everyone else know in the comments down below. And then if you're new to the channel, we upload videos all the time on AI marketing, sales, business growth. So if you like that type of content, you got some value here, then make sure to smash the like button, comment down below, and subscribe to stay up to date with the uploads. Also, too, guys, if you haven't already joined our free community on Facebook and Discord, stridecommunity.com, I'll leave a link down below. And then also, too, guys, we just are launching our Stride AI Academy. It's currently free, but it probably won't be in the future. So make sure you join right now while you still can. There's re there's a bunch of free resources, courses, etc. You're going to definitely get some value here, as well as you can network with myself, as well as other like-minded individuals. Other than that, guys, I will see you in the next video. Keep hustling, keep grinding, and of course, guys, accelerate your stride. Take care.